those guys aren't gonna get any experience. Alright, let's have Hector get this. Um, ooh, an unlock staff. Alright, we're gonna send that to Marlinus. Yeah, that actually can be useful from time to time. It can. Oh, snap. Um, ooh. Did not think about that, actually. Alright. Matthew should be dodgy enough. I trust him. I trust that he'll be dodgy enough. How far can you go? Alright, so Hollywood will now be in javelin range, which is okay. guys are gonna start coming. Alright, well, Marcus, he is ready. So is Guy. They are ready to start defending Marlinus. So, yeah. Um, let's end the turn. Oh, yeah. I, I don't have to worry about Matthew at all, although that's gonna do no damage. Yep. Two wastes of an iron sword. Oh, well. We wasted an iron sword there. Oh, well. Oh, thank you for missing. Okay, you should be able to uh, defeat him in another turn, hopefully. That'd be nice. And you're gonna miss Marcus, which is good. Yeah, this is the only reason why I have Marcus here. So he can help defend Merlinus. That is it. Yes, he is sucking up experience. You know what? I do not care. I do not care. Ow. Poor Hollywood. Uh. And here those guys come. Alright, we're gonna have Priscilla come on here. I'm gonna heal Rebecca up. There we go. Alright, and then I'm going to have Herc attack you. Perfect. I don't know, I'm singing cause I feel like it. I don't know, I feel like singing though. Yeah. How much are you going to do to Ellie Wood? You're gonna do 8 damage to him, okay. What if we have Matthew come here? And, eh. Uh, what to do here? Could have Lynn destroy you. Yeah, that'll work. Lynn, destroy him. Destroy this guy here. We need Priscilla to come in and heal Elliewood soon. Be uh, especially since, um... Didn't Ark take Elliewood's last revive? Yeah. Alright, we are going to we are here. Um, I'm gonna equip you with a rapier. Alright, and then Matthew can start getting stuff out of the chests. <clears throat> Hacker can get this out of here. Ooh, a hero crest and a knight crest. Nice. Um, yeah. We're gonna be wanting both of those for sure. Alright. Bam. Ouch. And bam, dead. Goodbye. Aw, oh, come on. Get up a level, guy. Get a level up, please. No, okay. Well, we're gonna heal you up now. <clears throat> and after that, we're gonna have Raven go talk to Lucius. Yeah. 
Lucius. Lord Raven, I'm so pleased to see you well. Things have changed. For the time being, we side with Kaelian. That is good, so you've had a change of heart? No, I will still have my revenge against House Ostia. The closer you are to the enemy, the easier it is to strike, right? L Lord Raven? Let's go, Lucius. Yes. Oh, poor Lucius. He seems kind of torn. Alright, well, uh, let's end the turn then. And here these guys come. Hello. Ouch. You with your iron sword and stuff. And guy gets a look. Get a strength buff. Strength. You need strength. Thank you. Oh, those are the stats we want. Those are the stats you, you're gonna you're gonna love. Although he, he a little bit more luck will help too. Why are why do swords ma sword masters always have really bad luck? I don't know. They need the luck. They need some luck. Ow. Okay, Elliewood, you've, uh, oh no, ah, here comes a flux master guy, whatever, um, alright, um, we're actually gonna have Rebecca attack you, perfect, steal bow time, dun dun dun, dun. and you missed, and you're dead, goodbye. Aw, no level up though. Oh well. How far can Priscilla? Okay. Well then we will have Elliot come over here with Lady Lindus. And we're gonna have you attack with uh, Thunder. Oh, whoops, I bumped the... Uh, I bumped the... Thing the my I bumped this little tiny table that my microphone is standing on. Yeah, it's a little tiny table. So what? Uh, yeah, nothing wrong with that. It's the only thing I uh, can use for right now. All right, we're gonna heal up Bollywood. Yeah, I like the skills in uh, Fire Emblem Fates. Like now, every time I have a healer, I always just like think they have the skill live to serve or yeah live to serve something like that where the amount of ooh silver sword nice uh the amount of hp that they heal um their ally that's how much hp um that's how much hp uh uh their um the healer will get back if they've lost any um, oh, you aren't going to... Okay, then. I see how it is. Get a crit? Nope. Darn. Oh, well. Alright, well, we're still going to heal him up anyways, because Sarah needs that good experience. She needs that well-earned experience. She needs it very badly. Alright, and then we're going to have Hector start making his way back over here, actually. Um, and then end. End the turn. Yeah. It's a very big map. I have to admit, it's a very big map. Ooh, um... Well, Marcus, you just stole Guy's experience. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Although, you're giving Sarah some time to heal stuff. Ooh, nice. Seven. Alright. Um... Yeah. Yeah, we should be able to KO you in the next turn. Ooh, we weapon level increase. Are you at C or B or what? The weapon level- ooh, critical hit. Hello, thank you, Marcus. Yeah, the weapon level experience growth rates or whatever, they, they, they grow really fast in this game. Not lying, they do. Alright, so see these three soldiers? You're gonna want to protect them because... Um, yeah. Oh wait, first I need to finish what I was saying. So, uh, weapon level uh, growths, apparently, um, in Fates, they are very terrible. <laughs> Takes forever for them to, for growth rates to, like, you know, grow. And depending on the weapon level rank, it'll also take a long time for them. So if you're like, beat A, 
it's going to take longer for that to grow than if you're going from E to D rank. Well, in Fates. At least that's what I've noticed. But, um, in these games, it doesn't seem to take that long. It really doesn't. Which is fine. You know what, I'm gonna, yeah, start supporting these two because I can and it'll be for the best. Um... Yeah, and then I'm gonna heal up Urk with Priscilla. Alright, there we go. Alright, so anyways, as I was saying earlier, you're, uh, gonna want to try to keep these three soldiers alive as long as possible. Why? Because... Um... Well... Uh, because, uh, depending on how many you keep alive at the end of the chapter, you will get a reward, and the best reward, and I am obviously gonna be getting the best reward because I'm keeping the three of them safe. Alright, you finally got some skill, and some more luck, and some HP. Nice. Alright, those are good. That is good. Um... You know what? I'll actually, um, do this. There we go. I should have the, uh, Rapier equipped to him, too, so... It's all good. Um, uh, yeah. We're good to end the turn now. Alright. Ouch. Ooh! Critical hit! Thank you! Thank you for that crit hit, Elliewood. Thank you very much. Um, hello. Ow. Priscilla can heal him up, no prob. Dun, 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 dun. Alright, we got another flux user guy here, so we're just going to attack him with Rebecca once again. While she's slowly building her support up with uh Lowen. Slowly, but surely, she is. And their supports are going to help them a lot. Ooh, weapon level increase. Where are you at now? Like, uh, ooh, B. Nice. Nice. I like that. Me likey. Um, eh, Thunder. Let's use Thunder Tomes because, ow. Hey, critical hit. Thank you. Thank you very much, Herc. Alright. Staff, heal. I'm gonna heal you up. Alright, um... Alright, we're gonna ha- we're actually gonna move Lynn over there so... Um, they can... <laughs> So I can lure the javelin guy in, and then I can have, I can just have Urk attack him, and then everything will be fine, just fine. Up oh, here they come. Hello. Any flex users? Nope. Okay, I think we're good to uh, bring in Lowen. Lowen, how are you? Yeah. Um. Yeah, we'll use that thunder tome. Bam. And miss. Bam! There we go. Destroyed. And Urk gets another level up. Okay, so I'm only using Urk for the time being. <laughs> that was dumb. Until I get another Anima Magic user. Because then I will be using them instead. But that Anima Magic user actually that I plan on using doesn't come around for a very long time. Not it like you don't get them until like chapter 25, 26, something like that. It is uh, it's going to be a long time before we get them. But in the meantime, Priscilla will actually promote to an Anima Magic user, so that will be very nice for us.
yeah, so that'll be very good. Oh, wow, uh, oh, doing nothing. Wow, okay, well, we need you then. Which is going to do nothing. A safe state that Oh I'll actually help. I am Bernard, Nyat Commander of Laws. I would test the might of those who bested Bucker. Yes, that voice was very necessary, guys. Ooh, miss. Nice. Yeah, see, supports help because with Rebecca being around, um, he, uh, well, Lowen doesn't take as much damage, and plus he can do more damage to, uh, Bernard. So that's really nice. Oh, he only has steel lance. Okay. Um, we can just end the turn right there. Okay, there we go. See, the heavy spear is coming in handy, guys. Ouch. Thank you. This is just a, this is a just reward for Law's brutality. Okay. Well, Lawen destroys a boss. Anything about that, guys? Ooh, skill, HP, and luck. I will take all of those. Thank you. Alright, and then we can just have Elliewood seize the throne. There we go. Grandfather! Grandfather! Where? Lord Hawson? Where are you? Elliewood, here on the throne. It's blood. Blood? No, it can't be. Lindis, calm down. He might only be injured. Come, let us find him. Yes, you're right. I must be calm. There, over there, someone. There's someone. Who's there? Show yourself. You, Leela. Yes, it's me, Lord Hector. It's been a long time. You know her? Yes, her name's Leela. She works for Ostia. All right, she's a spy. Lord Elliot of Frey and Lady Lindis of Kaelin, correct? I am Leela. Please make your acquaintance. Lady Lindis, Marcus Kalian is back there receiving treatment. My grandfather is safe? His life is yet his own. Ah, <sighs> Father Sky and Mother Earth, I thank you for your mercy. Leela, what are you doing here? I, I'm following Lord Uther's orders. I'm investigating Marcus Furry's disappearance. My father? What have you learned? Come with me, we should talk in private. Huh? Come on, Elliewood. Ah. Uh, worrying about things won't change them. I know. I'm fine. Let's go. <clears throat> Let me start with my conclusion. Marcus Frey is alive. Woo! Elliewood! That's wonderful! Are you sure? I've been posing as a member of the Black Fang for several months. That's where I got this information. I believe it is true. Black Fang. They're the Assassin's Guild that er Eric spoke of. Yes, we've known of their existence for quite some time. Explain. <sighs> the Black Fang is a guild of assassins founded about 10 years ago by Brendan Reed. They're based in Bern. Their arms reach quickly in several other countries. Originally, they targeted only nobles who abused their positions. The masses saw them as chivalrous defenders of the common man. Their activities found wide support. Chivalrous. Then about a year ago, Brendan got married again. Black Fang's operations have slowly changed since then. Now, they'll take on any target, no matter how difficult. As long as they're paid. And they're no longer killing mean only criminals. Anyone is a fair target. <clears throat> is the Black Fang responsible for what's happened to my grandfather? Yes. 
We've learned of a mystery man named Negril behind Reed's wife. It seems the Black Fang is performing secret tasks across Lycia for Negril. Negril's trusted retainer, Aethidal, is with Marcus Laws. He manipulated Laws into hatching the rebellion plot against Ostia. The first to answer Laws' call for rebellion was... Marcus Santarus. Lord Hellman, why would you? Next was Lord Albert Marcus Furry. You're telling me that my father endorsed this plan? I cannot say. I do know that he is with Marcus Laws currently. In a place called the Dragon's Gate. Dragon's Gate? Where's that? On an isle called Valor, off the southern coast of Lycia. I apologize, but that is all the information I have. Of all the places to be, Valor. Blast! What kind of place is it? It's said that those who step onto the island never return. The common folk call it the Dread Isle. If that's where my father is, however, I will go and find him. And this Dragon's Gate, too. I'm going with you. I'll tell you right now, you can't stop me. I'm also going. Lindus, I appreciate your kindness, but... Shouldn't you stay with Marcus Kalian? Laws must be stopped. Otherwise, they might target my grandfather again. I also wish to help Elliewood's father. Losing a parent... It's an unbearable pain. It's something I'd rather you didn't have to feel yet. Lindus, Hector, thank you. You give me strength. Don't mention it. We're friends. It's what we do, Elliewood. I'm also going to continue searching. Lady Lindus, I think it would be prudent to let the world think Marcus Kalian is dead. I understand. I'll do that. Thank you. No thanks necessary. If you'll excuse me... Leela! Yes? Negril and this fetal. What are they like? I've yet to lay eyes on Negril. I've spoken to fetal on several occasions, however. He's... eerie. He always wears a cloak that covers his face, and yet... What is it? His eyes glow golden. I can't miss them. They seem... inhuman. Is that you, Leela? Matthew, it's been a long time. What have you been doing? More dangerous work? We're spies, Matthew. Everything we do is dangerous. That's true. So, how long do you think this mission's gonna last? My objective is the same as yours. To rescue Marcus Furry things go well, I'll be in Ostia at the same time as you are. Is that so? You need to visit my hometown. Is this where you're born? Why? To meet my parents. Hmm? Matthew. Haha, <laughs> well, that's that. See you! As slippery as ever. Didn't even wait for my reply. Lady Lindus! Everyone, I'm happy to see you all well. I'm going after Marcus Laws. Protect my grandfather. One moment, Lady Lindus. Please take this jewel before you leave. Jewel? We were able to move it before Laws men ransacked our vaults. We will take care of Lord Hawson. Please, Lady Lindus, return to us safely. I will. Thank you. And we get the red gem, which is very nice. Except side quest. Yes, of course. Well, <laughs> um, I say I'm getting a little bit better at my voice acting, but I think it's just like this game. It the story is so compelling that it you know make, motivates me to play it and do like you know try my best at voice acting. So yeah, wait, well, making voice characters or whatever you know, like you know, put emotion into it. Yeah, that's what. Yeah, motion. So, yeah. All right. Um, well, that is all for today's episode, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, peace. Bye-bye, guys. I love you all. Later.